Hi, a Mero figure is a web application for creating and editing figures where every panel is a full image viewer where I can adjust the channels, I can zoom and pan the image. If I copy and paste panels, I can also adjust the Z and the T position of multi-dimensional images. I can also update, add and update labels. And I can add scale bars. I can save an image, a figure, and I can export to PDF and download the PDF where I can continue to edit in other applications, for example, in Illustrator. And here's one I've created earlier. Let me show you how to start a figure from scratch. I'll start a new figure and I'm going to bring images into the Amero figure from the web client using the image ID. Here's an image with ID is 509. So I'm just going to add that in here. So I can move panels around, copy and paste them and resize them in the same way as in Illustrator. But I can also snap them to grid. These ones are going to zoom and adjust the T index of these. If I copy this row, paste it, I can make multiple updates to channels. And I'll select them all. Let's update the rendering settings. Okay. And I can also do the colors. Let's add some labels. I'm going to select this top panel and simply add a label here. Row phase, choose the font size, and I can choose the position on the outside uh, or the inside corners or the outside edges. Let's stick with the top, black. And I can repeat that here. Phase. And a phase. Let's uh, zoom out a little more. And Confess all the panels by using the side handles here. Okay, I'm going to add some labels to the left. Um, and here I'm going to use existing channel names for this image and add labels to the left. 
So it's using the existing channel labels as well as the, the channels that are on and off and these images to generate these colored labels on the left. I'm also going to add a time label here. If I had timestamp information for this image, I'd be able to um, generate this automatically, but in this case, I'm just going to create these labels manually. In this case, I'm going to add them to the bottom left. So minutes. And I'm just going to make up some times here. Okay, um, and I'm going to add a scale bar. This image doesn't have um, pixel size uh, metadata as imported. M many images already have this metadata, but I'm going to add the pixel size as 0.2 microns, and that allows me to add a scale bar. Okay, so I can save that. And the search export as a PDF. That's available for download. But I can also go to see some of the other figures I've created here. Okay, well thanks for watching.